Stephanie Hardy for Women's Wrestling Talk, and I am standing here with the legendary Melina Perez. How are you, ma'am? I'm doing good, doing good. <laughs> a little bit sore, but overall, like, uh, I'm great, I'm great. Well, how did it feel to participate in such an event as Empower last night? Oh, my goodness. No, you're going to make me cry again. <laughs> it, was, it was just incredible. I, it's, uh, I really feel like all the, all the like, forces in the universe and all of time, it's just like all made it, it was its way for this one specific event. I felt every fan out there, like the love, the support, it's just so incredible. I've never, I've never felt anything like it, and it's just such an honor, especially with my friends, uh, my mentors, and then the future, like, you know, women of wrestling that, you know, it's just a beautiful, beautiful moment that I will never, I'll never forget. Yes, and I can say, you know, as being there in the audience, it was like that emotion was very palpable. I was happy to be there and then to experience you um, also as a fan. Like, I couldn't even believe that, like, wow, like, here is here she is in wrestling again and facing off against someone as dominant as Deanna Parazzo, the Impact Knockouts champion. Like, what was that preparation like going in there with someone as dominant as she? Well, she made it, she made it, well, this is the thing, though. I, as much as what was her inspiration, she, she could say her inspirations were, you know, other people. But when I look at her, I see, you know, me. So if I know in my heart what I'm capable of. It's not that I, I'm the dominant diva. So she could be dominant, but so am I. It's just the sad part is, is I'm not, I'm not uh, what, I, what I used to be. You know, I know that I'm older, but at the same time, that doesn't make, to, to me, I'll, I don't give up. I won't give up because this is what I love. So it's also inspiring because I love challenges. I love if somebody, like say I lost yesterday, but this is the thing, if you keep winning, then does, it just gets boring. It gets boring, but when you lose, that's the moment where you realize, you realize, okay, I have somewhere to go. That just makes me more hungry. So if you thought I was hungry before, if you thought I was passionate before, oh, I, I just got a lot, whole lot more passionate about winning. It's so funny that you say that because even though you did come up short in your match against Deanna Perrazzo, like... I believe this is a great place to ask, you know, what more of what the future holds for you. Like, are you wanting to challenge for that title again or are you looking towards, you know, another um, path? Oh, definitely. Def like the sky's the limit. That that's the beauty of what's going on right now with Empower, with Wims Wrestling across the board. Now we have tag titles. All of it. All of it is up for grabs. Like the, to me, yeah, I'm going for everything. <laughs> Well, in going for everything, um, it is really great to see you do that. So what does the future hold for you? Like, do, like, what does the future hold for women's wrestling? What do you see happening in the future for women's wrestling? Oh, my goodness. Now I, I, I could see in the future uh, all women's shows. Like, totally. I think people didn't see... I mean, you see it, like, attempted, and then not, it didn't work out as well. Something. And I really believe that it's because it was all women. The, the people backstage, everybody, everybody. Because sometimes you can have guys, and they have a vision, and it's great, you know? But at the same time, they don't know, understand the psyche of women. And here with Mickey, Gail, Medusa, every, like, they, they knew it because they, all, they were also wrestlers themselves and they understand what we're trying to achieve. So it ended up working perfectly. So they made it happen. We were trending uh, like, oh, it, this, this, is, this was history. History being made that women need a spot in wrestling, a more dominant spot, and we're gonna get it. So you're gonna see a lot more women, uh, women um, all women's shows now. Well, thank you so much for sharing your time with us. It was such an honor to see you perform last night, and I can't wait to see what, the, what more of the, what the future holds for you, uh, Ms. Melina Perez. It just meant so much to me to see you um, do that, and it's just great. So thank you, guys. Um, this is Women's Wrestling Talk. I'm the number one wrestling show on the planet.